show you how to paint monster clay using standard acrylic paints. All you're gonna need, all you're gonna need, all you now all you're gonna need, now all you're gonna need, now all you're gonna need, all you're gonna need, now all you're gonna need, now all you're gonna need. Now all you're going to need to follow along with this video is obviously some monster clay, some standard matte varnish, and some black primer spray. Um, I think this is matte, although it doesn't say anywhere. And obviously you're going to need some acrylic paints. Okay, so the first thing you're going to need is obviously something sculpted in monster clay. This is just a head sculpt I was working on, never really finished it. Um, and I don't mind using it just for this uh, demonstration. So give the sculpture a few light coats of the matte spray. Hold your can about 30 centimeters away from the actual piece, doing very short uh, controlled bursts, moving over the sculpt as you go. I'm now gonna hit it with a black coat of primer. As I said, you can use any primer, um, as long as it's okay for metals and plastics. It might be a good idea to do a very light coat of primer to start with and then wait for it to dry and go over it and check it to see if you've hit all the, the recessed parts. Um, any places that you want it to be very dark and very shadowy, it's a good idea to get the primer in there. Uh, don't get too close to the sculpt when you're spraying because you'll get paint building up in the, and pooling in the cracks, which is never a good idea. You're going to lose all of that lovely detail that you've sculpted. Um, and that's it. We're going to wait for this to dry. So what I'm going to do is just quickly lay down some very basic base colours just to show you how well it takes the paint. I've just got a nice blue base colour here. If you were doing this technique without uh, varnishing and priming your work, what would probably happen with monster clay is you'd probably start lifting off the base colour that you put down. So this is, like I say, a very quick idea of what I would normally do an idea of what's possible when you follow the techniques that I've showed you today. All right, so that's it. That's how you paint monster clay. Uh, it's not difficult. Uh, it just takes a few little steps, a few little things you need to know so you can get all of your sculpts painted and ready to be displayed or to take photographs of to add to your portfolio for example. I'm just talking shit. So thanks very much for watching. Please let me know in the comments how you get on with this. I'd love to know how it goes. If you haven't tried Monster Clay yet, I recommend you do so. Um, and yeah, that's it.